Peter Chang here, and welcome to part six of our MI5 RC car build, and we're gonna go ahead and tackle steps three and four. For step three, we're gonna have two aluminum parts, and these essentially hold in the rear differential, and they're marked parts A and B. So we're gonna go ahead and tackle part A, and part A essentially just goes on the right hand side of the rear here. So we're gonna go ahead and wrench that in, and this is what part A looks like. And it's just, once again, it's just two screws, and we're gonna go ahead and wrench in part B. And essentially, other than just, you know, aesthetics and stuff, uh, uh, just, there really doesn't seem to be any difference with it, but uh, just aesthetically, you know, part A is on the right side and then part B is on the left hand side. And we'll just go ahead and wrench those parts in. And there we are. That looks awesome. And then we're going to go ahead and open up the other bag. And this is bag four of our kit. And this is the aluminum motor mount. And interestingly enough, there's just two screws that hold this in. So we're going to go ahead and get this aligned up here. And once we get it aligned up, let's see, we just double check for fitment, make sure that is lining up. We'll just go ahead and grab in two more screws. And once again, these are just the flathead screws and I'm using my trusty Schumacher two millimeter wrench to wrench these in. And there we go. So this is just one screw. And then it's lining it up. And I'm just going ahead and tightening it down in there. And essentially, that's it for this, these two steps. And everything looks awesome. Thanks for watching.